Hi, in this video, I will show you how you can 3D print in multicolor using a normal 3D printer. Okay, first thing first, for this method to work, you need a multicolor filament that has the same printing temperature, like a PLA and silk PLA can be print with the same temperature. The printer we will be used today is ANET A8 with a Marlin firmware installed. And this is how this multicolor design works. Our 3D printer can only print one type of material at a time. So we will have to manually pause the print and change the filament at a specific height to achieve a multicolor 3D printed. In this design, we will print with a green filament first, then change to red filament at 2.2 mm height, and change again to the silk gold filament at 3.8 mm height. If your printer are running a Marlin firmware, there is an M600 command that is supported in Prusa Slicer which will pause the print and show a filament changing menu, then resume printing automatically. If your printer does not support M600 command, then you may have to pause the print and change the filament manually. And for the slicing software, I use Prusa Slicer version 2.2.0. The STL file for this print can be found in the video description. In a preview screen, drag the layer slider down to the height where you want a color change to occur. In this design, we want to transition from green to red at about 2.2 mm height. Then place the plus button next to the slider. This will add an M600 filament change command to the final G code. Then again move the slider to the 3.8 mm height and place the plus button to add a color change command for a transition from red to gold filament. Now it's time for printing. Now the printer was paused at 2.2 mm height. I'm changing from green filament to the red filament. After loading the new filament, place the OK button and the printer will push the old filament. Now you should check to see if the color of the push filament is completely changed to the new color. If not, you will have to push the filament again. Then select continue to resume printing.
Now the printer was pulsed once again at 3.8 mm height. I'm changing from red filament to the e silk gold filament. The changing process is the same as the first change. Now the printing was complete. That's it for today. If you like this video, please consider hit the like button, share and subscribe. Thanks for watching and Happy New Year! See you next time! Goodbye!